Hi guys, so today I thought I would shoot a video sharing a product I purchased to try to get this cord up off the floor because as you can see the lo dog logs, the logs, <laughs> the dogs like to be back in this area behind the chair and they like to run through here. And I'm scared this cord, I'm scared they're going to get caught on it and topple this lamp over. So, um, this lamp used to be, um, over here next to the TV. We had a smaller TV that was on this, um, TV stand. Well, recently we brought our bigger TV up from the basement and it's just, there's just not enough room for that lamp there. It just doesn't work right. So we moved it over there. So... I also bought the product for um, these cables here hanging down from the TV. I hate it. <laughs> so I also bought the product for that. I'm hoping it works. Now, um, here's the product right here. Look at this. I, and I think that's about how wide it is. And look at the packaging it came in. The biggest packaging ever. And they sent them all, I ordered them all on the, at the same time. They sent them all separately. Weird. But anyways, let me get this product out of the box and we'll be back. Okay, got it out of the box. And now I can show you um, what it's called. Cordmate. It's five foot long and it's to hide and organize a single cord. I think they sell wider ones, so if you want to hide more cords in it. And what it has is like a slit here to put the cord in, and then it has this sticky backing um, to stick to the wall. Now, this is too long, so let me see the best way to show you guys this. <laughs> um, Is it too long? Yeah, because I want it to... Yeah, so my husband's probably going to have to cut. What it's going to do is sit right along top of the molding down there. So you won't really be able to tell. So I'm going to have to have my hus husband cut off about 12 inches, it looks like. Hopefully it cuts easily. I'm looking on the packaging. Um, and it doesn't really say. It says you can paint it, which I'm hoping my landlord has some um, wall paint, this color paint left, so I can paint it. And then it'll even blend it in more for over there. So scoot back, Magnum, so I can sit this here. <laughs> Um, I, I wanted to share this product because I thought it'd be good for people with dogs that like to chew on cords or puppies that like to mess with cords. So I'm going to wait for my husband to get home. I'm going to have him cut it and then we'll see, or Magnum who likes to eat the cord hider. <laughs> yes, he likes to eat stuff. So when he was younger, he chewed, uh, my, um, power cord for my cell phone. So I thought this product would be neat to share for people who may have dogs that they have a problem with that, with cords. Or if you have kids and you have a problem with cords. So I'm going to wait for him to get home so he can cut it so I don't mess it up. And then we'll put it on the wall and show you what it looks like. Well, there we go. I got my husband to cut down the uh, tubing and... There it is, up on the wall, out of the way. The dogs rarely ever go this way. So I'm not worried about that going across. Um, they always run like right here. <laughs> I was trying to get my pointer. This is my pointy, pointer right now. Yeah, this is my pointer. <laughs> so anyways, there it is, up against the wall. I'm very happy, so now the dogs won't trip on that. And then, you can't have my pointer. No. <laughs> Here's the uh, cords in the tubing here. And I like like it so much better. The, the walls are really light. They're almost a white. Um, they're very light gray. So the tubing is just much better. It just goes straight down. The cords aren't kind of hanging weird. The big black cords. So tell me what you guys think. I'm still going to get... Um, with my landlord to see if he has any of this wall color left because they painted these walls 
uh, right before we moved in. So I'm going to see if he has any left and I could paint over the white so it would blend up in even more. But I'm happy with it just the way it is even. And I'm hoping um, I'm on my wish list. And I know it's not even summer yet, but I already have a Christmas wish list. <laughs> um, I'm trying to talk my husband into buying me a... Um, so this TV stand and electric fireplace, so it'll be a little bit wider and come up even more about to right there. So you'll barely see those anyways. So tell me what you guys think. If it looks better than the cords just hanging there. I think it does. Yes. And now you boys won't trip when you're running through there playing. Right? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so once again, the um, project is called cord mate and there's different if you see here on the packaging there's different parts you can get so it has like corner pieces and ones you can connect them like this one shows a telephone on the wall I don't know does anybody still have a telephone on the wall I don't know <laughs> I know we haven't for a long time since I think I lived at my mom's house <laughs> and that was oh gosh 20 25 years ago <laughs> I don't remember but um anyways there's different pieces too and these will only fit one cord like these big round cable cords here only one cord will fit in this one I have which looks like it's called C10 um now these skinny these skinny um cords here you might be able to fit two in might but they may have wider um tubing too and it's stuck right on the wall and then ain't coming off so anyways hope this video if you got hopefully you guys liked it it's not really a dog product even though i'm using it i mainly got it to get this cord away um and then i started looking and thought well why couldn't i put them there <laughs> so give this video a thumbs up and a comment let me know how you like it and we will talk to you guys in the next video all right bye bye